Welcome to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very interesting radical equation. It is x equal to square root 40 times x plus 8 over x plus 2. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started. By writing x must be greater than 0. Now I will consider squaring both sides. So from RHS, we can cancel a square root with a square. So x square will be equal to 40 times x plus 8 over x plus 2. We can cross multiply and write x square times x plus 2 will be equal to 40 times x plus 8. Or we can write x cube plus 2x square equal to 40x plus 320 or x cube plus 2x square minus 40x minus 320 equal to 0. Now we can find the eligible factors of leading coefficient and constant term. So I can write plus minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 4, plus minus 5, plus minus 8, plus minus 10 and so on. And leading coefficient it is 1 so I can write factors plus and minus 1. Now we have to take the ratio for our base solution. Let me write here x cube plus 2x square minus 40x minus 320 equal to 0. Let's plug in x equal to 5. As we have negative 320, so we can start from 5. 5 cube is 125 plus 50 minus 200 minus 320. No, it is not satisfying the equation. If I will plug in x equal to negative 5 minus 125 plus 50 plus 200 minus 320. No, it is not satisfying. If I will plug in x equal to 8, 8 cube is 512 plus 2 times 64, 128 minus 40 times 8, 320 minus 320. Now this addition is 640 minus 640 which is true solution. So I will say x equal to 8 is our base solution or we can write x minus 8 is a factor of cubic equation. Now I will use long division. I will write here x minus 8 x cube plus 2x square minus 40x minus 320. Let's divide. I will take x square times so it will become x cube and minus 8x square. Change of sign will be there. This will be over. I will write 10x square minus 40x minus 320. Now we have to consider 10x times. So it will give us 10x square minus 80x. Again sign change will be there. This will be over 80 minus 40, 40x minus 320. Now I will take 40 times. So plus 40 it will give us 40x minus 320. Remainder will be 0. So our factorization will be x minus 8 times x square plus 10x plus 40 equal to 0. So we can conclude from here either x minus 8 will be equal to 0 or the quadratic equation will be equal to 0. So x square plus 10x 
प्लस फोर्टी इक्वल टू जीरो सो फ्रॉम फर्स्ट इक्वेशन आई कैन राइट एक्स इक्वल टू एट नाउ फ्रॉम सेकेंड इक्वेशन लेट्स राइट हेयर आई विल राइट एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस टेन एक्स प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस फिफ्टीन this is split of 40 now from first three terms we can write it is x plus 5 whole square and if i will take plus 15 to the rhs i can write equal to minus 15 the square is negative so complex solution is about to come so i can write i square equal to minus 1 so this will become 15 i square left hand side it is x plus 5 whole square now let us consider square root both sides x plus 5 will be plus minus i square root 15 now i will subtract 5 from both sides so i can write x will be equal to minus 5 Plus minus i square root fifteen, but we will reject this solution as it is complex. So rejected. So our only real solution it is x equal to eight. So I will write x equal to eight will be our solution. Now we have to verify. so i will write here check lhs will be x so it will be 8 rhs square root of 40 times x plus 8 so 8 plus 8 over i will write 8 plus 2 will be equal to square root 40 times 16 over 10 now we can cancel 10 in the numerator denominator so it will become square root 64 which will be equal to 8 rhs is 8 lhs is 8 so our solution 8 is true solution so i will write our final and only real solution it is x equal to 8 I hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching till next video bye bye and take care of yourself